Well, hello, good afternoon, and welcome wherever you are to FA Trophy fourth round action. It's the Bulls versus Torquay. So, the Bulls squad this afternoon in goal number one, Curtis Pond, two, Aaron Skinner, four, Oreo Tashira, seven, Yusufu Sise, number 15, Tom Pugh, 17, Tope Abidei. There we are, Abidei, our new signing. Uh, 20, Lasana Mendes, 21, Oli Southern. 22, Adam Rooney, 27, Nathan Cameron, and 28, Carl Hawkins. Uh, on the bench, Adam Livingston, Shea Sterry, Mark Derricott, Jack Tolley, and Arwin Wolby. For the goals, uh, in goal number one, Mark Halstead, six, Ross Marshall, 10, Lewis Collins, uh, 14, Brett McGavin, 17, Dylan De Silva, 11, Will Jenkins Davis, 19, Dwayne, or, right, I'll get this, Alfori Atampong, uh, 21 Dean Moxie, 23 Ollie Tomlinson, 26 Archie Harris, and 32 Osman Foyo. And on the bench for the goals, Dan Martin, Asa Hall, Reese Lovett, Callum Thomas, and Tom Chatsy. And we are off. Thank you, Frank. Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome along to this uh, Isuzu FA Trophy fourth round match between Hereford and Torquay United. It's uh, National League North versus National League South down the line towards Foyo. Cleared though by Hereford and Tope Obaday has his first opportunity to run of the game. Nice turn from the winger. Plays it out nicely to Cisse. Driving at the Torquay defence here. Not too far from the edge of the box. On his right foot has a shot. Just past the right hand post there of Halstead. And allows Skinner to pick up the ball. Nice through ball to Tashira. Carrying it forward now. The former West Brom man played to Cisse through the legs of Marshall towards Tashira nice turn from the midfielder he's inside the box here can he find a pass yes he can and it's top of a day but the flag went up very early there four offside talking with the ball now on the halfway line nice switch of play over towards De Silva nicely brought down as well on his chest squares up Skinner looking to get that cross into the box in it comes towards the near post Curtis Pond though with good hands it's taken short to Cisse back with Tom Pugh, now to Shearer, just on the edge of the box from 25 yards out, urge to shoot, deflection, force to Cameron, Halstead comes out, still in play, still in play here, Hereford with the ball though, Cissé attacking now, just outside the talky box, a nice play from Cissé there, driving in, fires it, straight at Halstead. It's in quite a central position, so yeah. perhaps a difficult angle to try and find one of those corners. I think it's Pugh. Yeah, it's Pugh that steps up, it's a great free kick into the top right hand corner, Fantastic free kick there from the right footer, Tom Pugh. Stepped up nonchalantly and curled it beautifully into the top right-hand corner of Mark Halstead's net. And he's given Hereford the lead. It's Frank. one of those free kicks. It's just far enough out. If it had been any closer, he wouldn't have got that sort of bend on it. He needed that distance. And, of course, the wall didn't jump. And he celebrates the extension to his loan deal with Hereford's first goal. Yeah, brilliant free kick from Tom Pugh, the Scunthorpe Loney. It was between golden him and goal time somewhere around the 19 minute mark. If you've uh, got a golden goal ticket, we'll bring you the result of that as soon as we get it. Torquay, though, inside the Hereford half, looking to come forward and respond. It's switched over nicely to De Silva, just on the edge of the box. Squares up Skinner on his right foot. Shots back in on his left. Cross comes in towards the back post. Pond doesn't claim. It's still live in the box. Cleared by Cameron under a sliding challenge. McGavin brings it down though. Collins on the edge of the box. Dispossessed by Hereford. Foyo wins it back though. McGavin now with the ball. On now to Foyo. Shoots on his left foot. Straight into the grateful arms though of Curtis yeah, Pond. For an option here, the number 17. Finds Marshall who's overlapped. Cissé's dropped back to defend. Finds Collins who whips it in towards the back post. But Pond is better with his handling this time round than he was 10 minutes ago. And he a curler it. inside the right hand post would look nice wouldn't it? Cissé who strikes and it's oh. in the post. Exactly as we thought. And over to Cissé deep inside the talky half here driving at Marshall once more on his left foot looking to find a pass into the box Marshall does well to block the attempted cross in it comes though from Tashira towards the back post brought down by Southern on the edge of the box Torquay desperately trying to stave off this threat from Hereford here. Good play from the balls. Finds Cissé once more. He's driving at Marshall. Cross towards the back post. Finds Mendes on the other side of the box. Plays it through the legs of Harris. Goes down under the challenge from Harris. Penalty says referee Richard Ely. 
Cissé steps up and scores. Consummately into the bottom left-hand corner of Halstead's net and Yusufa Cissé has doubled Hereford's lead after 35 minutes. Absolutely, and it's just what the Bulls have deserved for all their possession and all their uh, enlightened play. It's the only thing I can say. We have got such an exciting, talented bunch of players here at the moment. And you've got to think, this isn't the first choice team, for heaven's sake. You know, we've got three players out injured who you'd say would walk into the side normally, and the suspended player who would walk into the side normally. We, it is such an exciting squad of players we've got at the moment. Yeah, it's uh, Marshall's throw-in, who's just found Obidé from the clearance from Hereford in his shot from his left foot. By Jenkins Davis short for De Silva on his right foot. Back though to Jenkins Davis on the edge of the box. Whipped in by De Silva. Not too close to goal, though, from De Silva. Tomlinson knocks it back in towards the back post. Jenkins Davis is there. Rooney heads clear, though, and then subsequently on by Hereford. And the referee has deemed that Harris controlled that Mendes. ball by... Mendes with the uh, to take it through, to Mendes. through to Mendes just on the edge of the box here can he finish the number 20 House comes out and claims well though alert to the danger of the Torquay United goalkeeper before pushing on corner comes into the box towards Marshall it's fallen to Harris shot comes in Obade now onto to Shearer coming forward nicely with a little bit of skill there to Shearer can he slide in Rooney chops his on his left foot instead finds Mendes in the box <laughs> he shoots and it's just wide of the post but it would not have counted anyway as Tom Pugh whips it into what's the near post and it's actually off the post and out straight for a talky goal kick now to Shearer centrally a little bit of pressure on the number four and it's been pinched from him it's been given to the number eight there Marshall he has a look for goal Curtis Pond's goal kick played up towards Rooney, brought down by McGavin, trying to play it over the top of Livingston towards De Silva, but Livingston's got the pace to deal with that and plays it back to Pond. Slightly sloppy clearance though from the Hereford goalkeeper. Finds De Silva now on the edge of the box, play back to McGavin who shoots, but it's over the bar. Left foot, sorry, of Jenkins Davis or the right foot of McGavin. It is McGavin, he shoots directly, saved by Pond though, and well held. Clip ball over the top to Harris now. Ball forward now to Co to Marshall. Sorry, nice flick ball to Harris. Back now to Marshall on a deflection off Cameron. Just yeah, so ball comes in from Jenkins Davis towards the back post. Pond comes and claims assuredly this time though. Jack Tolly drives with the ball. It's Rooney now on to Cissé. Cissé now carrying the ball forward in trademark style. Cuts his on his right foot. Finds Tolly inside the box. Shot comes in from the winger, but it's blocked by Moxie and it falls into the hands of Halstead. Back to Skinner. Now Mendes. Now on to Tashira. Livingston. Now Rooney, who's just made his way onto the left wing, slides it through to Livingston. Cross comes in towards Tom Pugh, cleared by Torquay just in the nick of time. Pugh was lurking there on the centre circle. Harris being pressured by Skinner, and he does well. The Hereford right back to win the ball. Cross comes in from Tolly, finds Pugh in the centre of the box. Can he shoot? Yes, he can, but it's blocked by Moxie and. The ball finds its way through to Halstead with the free kick. Torquay know this one's gone now. Just uh, waiting to see this one out. They have a National League South playoff chase to get underway with next week. As do Hereford, indeed, in the National League North. Referee just about to put the whistle to his lips. And indeed, he does. It's finished here. Hereford 2, Torquay United 0. The damage was done for Hereford in that first half. Tom Pugh got the scoring underway after Cissé had been brought down on the edge of the box and Pugh bent it beautifully into the top right-hand corner of Halstead's net to give Hereford the lead. The 37th minute saw Mendes foul by Harris, allowing Cissé to convert for the spot for 2-0. The second half, in truth, didn't see too much action as Torquay didn't pose too much of a threat as they looked to try and get back into the game. But in truth, it was always Hereford's game to lose. And that's the way it finished at Edgar Street. Hereford FC 2, Torquay United 0. And they march on to the last 16 of the FA Trophy.